am I going to use to clean my hands now? <sighs> I've got tissue right here, right here. Looks like I'm organised, isn't it? Okay, cool. We're all nice and clean. Hey guys, so I wanted to share a new product, Love. Now, I blame one of my lovely viewers. Who was it? Let me see who it was. Her name is Amor Moreno, telling me about how good this product was. Hmm. Do you know, I'm not mad at you because I'm loving it myself, so thank you so much. But you know the whole product junkie thing, I'm a bit... You know, I did my rehab a few years ago and I'm a bit touchy, you know, I'm a bit sensitive on the topic. But, but one must try new products one must try new products and that is definitely what i'm doing i'm loving my transitioning i'm loving my natural hair i'm enjoying my transition i love it i'm so in love with my 4c hair thank you jesus there's nothing ugly about it it is stunning okay let me just reveal to you let me reveal it to you okay i never knew that i would be so in love with this The Elasta QP Olive Oil and Mango Butter Growth Moisturizer. It's the Growth Moisturizer. This product, guys, I, I'm really loving this product. Let me just, this is my first impressions. It's not an official review. I'll do an official review like after at least a month or two or three, but this has just been like two weeks. So it says, Moisturizing butter of mango and olive oil helps strengthen and protect hair against breakage, breakage, split ends and dryness. Perfect for all textures to help reach your nat hair's natural growth potential. Working, these are the directions, working section by section, gently finger comb from roots to end to moisturize and redefine your natural texture. Styling uses, apply a small am amount to ponytails, braids and afro puffs to hydrate, smooth and control frizz. Excellent when applied lightly before blow drying to silk and texture now before i go into how much i love it i thought it was important to compare it to my olive oil and mango butter moisturizer just the first few ingredients so let's compare so and this one actually has glycerin in it you know and it's but it's further down the ingredient list so they both have aqua as their first ingredient second one for this one is glycine soya oil slash soya bean oil the second one for this one is Olea fruit oil. I think that's olive oil. So it's pretty similar having oils for the second ingredient The third one for this is hydrogenated vegetable oil. This one is capric capri prolific triceroides So and then after that for this is glycerin and then after that for this is lanolin Lanolin the ingredients are actually different. So it's not the same thing. It smells very similar and let me just show you the consistency actually because I think it's important to compare these products because I was thinking to myself before I bought this that I hope that it's just not like a repackaged version of this one because I really won't be impressed this is the Elasta QP and Mango Butter Moisturizer the cream this is the this is not the moisturizer well it is the moisturizer but it is it's not the growth I'm confused you know this is not the growth moisturizer okay so it's thicker it's a cream it's more of a cream as you can see guys so that's the consistency of this is what I I think it's important to use a cream for my um lock method actually because the consistency is just right it's just it's just right you know and then this is the moisturizer consistency so it's more of a moisturizing kind of I don't know if you can if you know what I mean but look at the difference this is a creamier thing and this is more like a moisturizer so I think I'm using them right in terms of like their properties okay, first of all very reliable you can rely on this for moisture it says apply a small amount correct you don't need much of this at all so basically what I do is I do my lock method with my um, leave-in is the proline comb through soft on my oil which is the grape seeds oil and my elastic qp over there just sitting pretty over there my moisturizer but that is a cream to me that's more of a creamy consistency okay and it's good for braid outs too but this one i use like my daily regimen of 
when I, I do my water, oil and moisturiser and this would be my moisturiser in there. It does everything it says. I didn't know this would be so amazing for 40 hair but you know what, when you do your lock method then anything is possible. Okay, not anything is possible but when you do your lock method you don't need much, it doesn't take much to keep your hair to you know preserve that moisture for the week this i'm really loving it guys and i'll have an official review soon just to give you an overall view of what i think but so far it's really doing it for me it just feels so nice to have found you like it's a blessing oh thank you jesus